Hello Tendo friends, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna have a quick unboxing of this beautiful K80. You can find it in AliExpress for $34 with 23 cents. You can choose different colors, black, silver, and gold. Of course, you can switch the straps real easy. I love this combination right here, gold and black. And if we go to the specs, it's a round display 1.43 inches, 466 by 466 pixels. We come with a battery with 260 milliamps hour, magnetic charging, Bluetooth 5.2, that will give us a very stable connection, is full screen touch, and rotatory button or crown. IP68 and you can pair it to Android 5.0 and above and iOS 9.0 and above. If we go ahead and remove the cover inside we will find the smartwatch. It looks really nice. If we take it out in the bottom of the box we will find the quick guy. It comes in Chinese and, and English also. In the box we will find the charger cable too. From this side USB type A and from this other side magnetic connection right here we have the smartwatch let's remove the protector on the back we come with another protector make sure you remove it before you start wearing it and here we have it look at that i really like the round corners and that matching color black and gold and as you see it's very well built if we go all around look at that you can clearly see all the details around like i said it's very well built perfect if we go from this side we come with the crown if we turn it you can clearly hear that click sound right in the center we have the microphone and right here on the bottom we have the second button now as you see the crown and the button right here is more shiny but I think it makes it looks real nice. From this other side, we come with the speaker and from the back, we have the charging interface, the sensor, and as you see, you can easily remove the straps. You can buy different colors. Just make sure you get uh, 22 millimeters and they will fit just fine. If we go ahead and take its measurements, we come with 46.3 millimeters and its thickness is 12.2 its weight is 41.8 grams the smartwatch itself and 56.7 in total with the straps on now if we go ahead and turn it on we press the crown and hold it you can clearly see it. he gave us the hello message now we have the qr code to scan it and download the app you can skip it if you want but in our case we're gonna go ahead and scan it and download the app as you see you will have to install the CoFit app and there we have its screen it looks really nice if we touch on the icons of course we come with the uh, shortcuts i really love that even that they are so tiny but they still working if we turn its scrum of course it will switch the alts if we touch on them, some of them will change color like this one that's the night mode. This is the type of watch face I really like. You will have the main functions on it. So you just touch and go straight to what you need. If we keep on going, we come with some other more. Look at that one right there. Another one. Oh, that one looks real nice. Well, you can choose between analog or digital. Some of them are combined look at that one right there that one looks cool we still have some more you can switch them like that or you touch on the screen hold it and now we are on the switching interface as you see down there we'll count with 11 different ones you can uh, add some other ones from the app if we go from top to bottom we will have the shortcuts look at that i really like it so like i said we will count with shortcuts you can turn on off the bluetooth right here it will uh turn on like the always on display but it only will last five minutes but we are talking about the main screen it has some pointer that will stay on all the time i'll show you later from here you can access to your alarms add it if you want control the brightness let's leave it like it was and go to settings sleep mode if we go from left to right, we will be able to add some widgets. 
and if we go to the other side it will only switch uh, the order from button to tap we will have our notifications if you press the crown from the main screen it will take you straight to the apps menu you can press twice to switch it if we go like this as you see it has a uh, a very decent refresh rate if we press it twice again well it will keep switching between all the menu styles that will offer you if we press and hold the crown you will be able to turn it off factory reset or reboot if we press the button button right here it will take you straight to the sport from here all the way to the bottom you can with 10 different ones but you can go right here and add some more like this one right here if you go to fitness you will find some more it will be up to you which category you want to go in and you can reorder the position if we go to the apps menu i will pass it real quick you can uh, pause the video if you want to see if uh, it count with the apps that you need the most we count with voice assistant of course and there we have it if we go to settings we will be able to switch the dials add a password that way you protect your information turn on the do not disturb mode switch the language from here you can switch the menu style and it will give you an idea how it will look and the standby dial okay from here if you turn this on you can choose from digital or pointer dial that way when the main screen goes off if you choose the digital one it will show you this it will remain on all the time or you can choose this other one right here remember this will stay on all the time while you have it on so it will take some of your battery but it's a really nice feature to have and from here you can turn on off the gesture mode or you can switch the time that this the main screen will remain on you can go from 5 seconds to 30 seconds when you receive a notification the screen will bright up and it will show you the message as you see you will be able to delete it but in case that the message go away just like you see you can count right here and see it again like i said you can delete it if you want it has a really good vibration but you can choose if you want that vibrates just once or three times when you get one in that way you don't lose any of your notifications now in case of a call it will show you the contact name vibrate continuously and you will be able to hang up or answer the call from here you will be able to switch to the phone or back to the smartwatch mute or hang up and of course from here you will be able to control your music playing on the smartphone now something really nice is that you can choose if you want that the music sound on the phone that way if you're wearing your uh, bluetooth handphones it won't be a problem but if you want the music sound on the smartwatch you can switch right here and that's how it will sound From the app, really nice, you will be able to receive notifications from all of your apps installed in the smartphone. And you will have plenty of other options to choose from. Now, let me show you in settings. This is uh, something that people ask me a lot. If they can sync with Strava or Google Feed, well, in this one, we can. Of course, from the app, you can upload some other uh, watch faces. It won't be a problem. Or you can use uh, the custom face from here. It will give you some uh, tools to build your own watch face. Or you can still use uh, a picture from your album. Up the option of take a picture if you want. Now, let's go ahead and put them on. And this is how it will look. Real nice. Tell me what you think. Another watch face right there. Well, this is it on this video. I'll see you in the next one.